Hi, this is Amy at the Altice store. Today I'm going to go over the features in a Morningstar TriStar charge controller. Now this is a really powerful tool. You can do a lot of different things based on your system with the TriStar. Now it can be set up to be used as a charge controller or it can be set up to be, to be a load controller. So it, it will disconnect your load if your battery gets too low. Or it can be set up as a diversion load controller for hydro, solar, or wind, where if your battery bank gets overcharged, it will actually turn on a load such as a heater, a water heater or an air heater, that will draw the, the voltage off the, the battery bank so that as you're charging, say with, with uh, hydro, you're going to be using that power as well, so you're not going to overcharge your battery bank. This is really important because you, you don't have the ability to just disconnect your hydro. Now, we have lots of different options with the, the TriStar. It does come standard uh, with, with a set of LEDs, three LEDs that give you different information, state of charge, error messages, um, di just a lot of different uh, status um, indications. But it also has an optional meter that you can replace the, the blank front and replace it with a meter. This will give you a lot more information, will give you uh, voltage and current information, gives you alarms, faults, lots of diagnostics. So it's really nice to be able to see what's going on with your system. Another option for that is actually a remote meter. So you can actually display, display what's going on in your system someplace away from your battery bank. So you would just connect it to, uh, to the battery um, locally and then have your display someplace else so that you can see easily what's going on. The uh, charge controller feature is, is very powerful. It has, it has uh, four different charging modes. It's got the, the uh, pulse width modulation regulation, or PWM. Uh, it's got equalization capabilities. It's got uh, float mode, so if your battery is full, it's just going to very gently keep it topped off. It's got a high voltage disconnect so that if the battery is full, it will disconnect from it so that it's not going to overcharge it. You do have the ability to do auto or manual equalization based on how you configure it for what type of battery you've got. If it's a flooded lead acid, if it's sealed, if it's a gel, it gives you different capabilities based on the different type of battery. So you actually can connect it to a computer so that you can remotely configure it and remotely log the data. Really nice to be able to keep track of what's going on with your system. So um, the charge controller itself is available in a 45 amp or 60 amp version. They each can be configured to be 12, 24 or 48 volts. So it can really handle a, a nice size PV system. If you have more than that in your, in your array, what you, what you would do is you would have multiple charge controllers. You would break out your, your panels into two different arrays, each with its own charge controller, and they both can go to the same battery bank. So it's a very powerful pulse width modulation charge controller, diversion load controller, or a high voltage load disconnect. So that is the Morningstar TriStar. Thanks for watching. Bye.